Hello everyone, um, hope everyone is doing great. Um, this is my first ever tutorial on uh, Mac OS and uh, this is my first ever MacBook Pro as well. I am an IT professional and I have been working this field since last uh, 8 to 10 years. I just wanted to record, this is my first experience, I wanted to see how the Mac OS and Mac Book Pro and Max hardware works. So I, I'm, I it's been just uh, maybe 36 hours I buy this. I buy it last night. As it's a used Mac Pro. It's a 2015 model, and uh, with 8 GB of RAM and 128 GB SSD storage, and this is working pretty well so far. And I don't know how this guy has done it, but it's coming with a pre-installed few applications. And I just uh, updated it to the new beta program Mac OS Mojave before it was having Mac OS Hysera and it was pretty good as well. So by watching all those tutorials and things on the YouTube and internet that how the Mac OS is working, I want to share my honest opinion and a first hand experience coming on a Mac. Okay. So the first of all is the hardware performance. Uh, you can see I have been monitoring this book uh, since last two three hours after updating, and I have also tested it on macOS Hysera as well. So in this part, we are going to launch multiple apps and see how this, how the load is going to be adjusted in this, uh, in this. Uh, you can say a short tutorial and intro whatever you can say. So first launch, uh, we will launch the Photoshop Photoshop CC and it's it, it has done pretty well. I was really impressed and even I have <laughs> took these one of the lessons and I try a few things. One of my friend is graphic designing. I think he's gonna love this MacBook Pro and Photoshop no problem at all. It's pretty easy, pretty decent and speedy let's go to another one this is Dolby After Effects hope this is going great uh, it takes a little while while launching okay I can understand as it is uh, video editing uh, software so it should take some time and with few seconds you can say it has launched please keep in mind the temperature temperature is rising so I will I speed the fans a little bit even my room is air conditioned but still it's uh, rising the bridge as I open the apps let's try another one I open this one so let's open this one Premiere Adobe Premiere meanwhile you can see the activity monitor see the system load is only 26% and 36% either you can see very easily that how this is working and this premiere is taking some time to be launched so it has launched let's see okay this is the demo okay open the demo project so with all these three heavy applications it's opened I would like to open app stores as well pretty quick no hard starts also I have opened my Safari web browser and I'm working on it on few things while researching on few things PC 8 that's a very nice uh, website uh, that's the a magazine for IT professionals who are working admin PC magazine I think this will work PC mag this PC yeah th this one this one I think So, yeah, this is a very good website by the way. You know, like to close it. Yep, we are here. We can go to the home page. 
and for the, for all those IT professionals they can find many things with this okay fine so just wanted to show you I have also my mail app launch pretty quick you know how it starts um, also the map is also opened and that's my friend who's lighting a cigarette and everything is working pretty quick so far I can see the temperature is still rising okay and temperature is still rising although I set it to the highest rpm you should see the fan speed is good this temperature rising is not good maybe my own temperature is not so suitable anyway so this is the quick tour for these things I have not starting I have no idea about how I do this uh, video dating and stuff uh, although I have basic idea about this one and some of these applications so we will quit them also this one and you will see the load will come down see it has come and the temperature will also come down in a bit I'm going to put this video on YouTube so you can see the MacBook Pro performance how it has gone so far so uh, my honest opinion the result is I'm loving this um, this notebook and it is a very nice pleasant shift from Windows to Mac especially if you're talking about the uh, graphic designing photo editing video editing it's it's a huge deal it's it's a huge tool for your work preferably if you use the iMacs and MacBook Pros and the newer models will be also very good so I'm pretty satisfied with that uh, and I'm also loving the change of flavor from Windows to Mac while browsing while tweaking in between the new things and things like that so let's just upload this video on YouTube and, and see you again bye for now